It appears as if the majority leader is hell bent to try to break the Senate. Uh, his argument is that somehow state legislatures across the country are busily at work trying to make it more difficult for people to vote. Of course, that's not happening anywhere in America. 94% of Americans believe it's easy to vote. Uh, we had a record turnout last year, uh, the biggest turnout since 1900. Um, it's already against the law to prevent people from voting based upon race. The Voting Rights Act is still intact. So it's appropriate to ask the question, what's going on here? Well, there's been a lot of talk about big lies. Well, the big lie on the other side is that state legislatures controlled by Republicans are busily at work trying to make it difficult for people to vote. If you actually read the legislation that's been passed, it's clearly not the case. And so I think this is an excuse to try to break the Senate. Hypocrisy is not unheard of in politics, but about half the current members of the Democratic Party when Donald Trump was president and we were in the majority believed that the legislative filibuster was the essence of the Senate. So I guess <clears throat> where you stand depends upon where you sit. And we anticipate based on what the majority leader said, he's going to try to break the Senate, break the legislative filibuster, to make some kind of narrow exception. There is no such thing as a narrow exception. No such thing as a narrow exception. 